And I like to call, I use positive connotations, I like to call this your initial investment, okay? Initial investment, if the customer's not catching on to that, then down payment, okay? So, but this would be, and now close your eyes, tell me what you see. Nothing. That's what most people want to put down, okay? That's what 99% of your people want to put down. All right, now I use something that I tell them that makes a lot of sense nowadays. I tell them, well, remember TARP? We gave them all of our tax pay, all our money and everything, these lenders to bail them out, okay? So I'd say, well, nowadays, now they want, you know, now we give them all our money, it, they're making it real tight and hard to get car, you know, car loans. So they're saying that some of them want as much as 30% down. Okay, so on this particular car, Mr. Customer, that would be a, I mean, a little over $6,000. It's about $6,200, okay? And I write it down big, okay? So, they, so they're feeling really at ease when, you know, because they've said zero. And I know you said zero, Mr. Customer, but I also know that you see here, you have 20 payments left in your car, correct, sir? Okay, so and your payments are 340, correct? And we know that you got a payment that's due now, right? Correct. If my, I'm sure my manager can make it to where you don't have a payment for 45 days, okay? So you can take 340 and then you're gonna have another payment in 30 days, okay? That's about $700 that you're gonna have in payments, okay? And you'll still have 15 days before you gotta make note. So we'd be safe to say that you can put at least $700 down, correct, sir? Correct. Okay, right. All right, now, over here, and this is where, if I was a car doctor to ask most people where it hurts, okay? This is where it hurts. Wouldn't you agree that it hurts each month what you're paying for that car? Okay. Yes. So this is where 85% of your people, that's all they care about. They don't care about all this, they don't care about this, they don't care about this. That's all they care about, okay? That's where it takes to cure me as long as you can give me this payment. Now, Mr. Customer, we were talking on the lot. I didn't get uh, exactly. What do you have set aside for your monthly budget on a new vehicle? On your new vehicle, um, three hundred dollars. Up to three fifty. Three fifty, great. And then just just write it down, but we write it down a little small. You know, you don't write it very big. The bigger numbers are the ones where they should be, where we want them to be. The smaller numbers are where they want to be. So we want our numbers in Boston, their subconscious side, more than theirs. Make sense? Makes sense. Okay. So. Once you do that, and you don't harp on it, okay? You don't just stay, it's up to, and that's it, okay, and drop. Because so now you have all the pieces to the puzzle. You have, you know, you have the trade-in, this is, and you have the balance owed on it. You have what their payments are, so, and that's all, and that's all you need in the trade box. You have how much money down they're gonna put. You have their payments that they wanna be around, okay? And most of them, like I said, are gonna be standing beside the car out there on the lot, 